Sam, it wasn't pretty early, but how important was it just to finish on the right note today, at last game at Amy? Yeah, it was obviously tough, tough to start the game off, and um, you know we really wanted to stick to what we, uh, you know, what we addressed before the game, and um, you know we knew that'd pay off in the end, and um, you know the scoreboard showed the end result, which was good. How about yourself? You had to wait a while to get back in the team and then sub last week. How'd you go playing a full game out there today? Yeah, look, um, you know to get in about or oh, 15 minutes last week to a full game today's. You know, it's completely different and I'm, I'm knackered to be honest. But um, no, nah, look, it's good to be back in the side and, um, you know, obviously to have a good win like that with the boys to, you know, hopefully finish the year off with a, with a strong and positive vibe, um, you know, would be really good. You played, I think it was eight or nine games in a row earlier in the year and then probably missed the same amount back in the SNFL. What was the message from the coaches for you during that time? Yeah, look, I had a few things I had to work on, um, you know, my running patterns, um, my kicking and, you know, just a few little things that, um, you know, are going to help me, um, you know, really really forged my career I guess in the game and um, you know it took a little bit longer than what I liked but hey that's you know that's footy and like I said it's it's good to finally be back and um, you know hopefully we can stay. Another guy who's made the most of his opportunity the last month or so Louis Johnson I think he had six today be pretty happy with that performance. Yeah he's a superstar isn't he so you know he's just thriving on getting his chance at the, at the highest level and you know he's grabbing it with both hands which is really good to see you know he's someone that uh, you know kicks bags in the SANFL every week but you know when we've got the likes of Joshy Jenkins and uh, Tex Walker, you know, take, taking up his space. He, you know, he doesn't he doesn't go away from what he does best, and um, you know, his sample form and you know his work behind the scenes is really starting to show out in the field for you know for everyone around the show to see. What's it been like for the young guys this year? Everything hasn't quite gone to plan for the team with a few injuries, but a number of young guys, including yourself, have got their chances. How beneficial is it for guys even getting a few a handful of games in this year? Oh, look, you know, it's been fantastic. Um, you know, you don't want anyone to get injured, and um, but look, it's opened, the, you know, it's opened the path for a few blokes, and um, you know, it's good to see a, a young young group really playing some good footy as well. So, you know, with the likes of Laird, Brown, Greg, Johnson, um, which has all been fantastic. So, um, you know, look, if we can keep getting games in, and the more games to play, the better you're going to get. So, um, you know, a handful of games here and there is um, fantastic. We like seeing you in the Crows jumper. Can we see you in the Crows jumper for a little while to come? Yeah, definitely. I'll be here for the next, you know, as long as I can be. So, that'll be good. Thanks, Sam. Appreciate it.